Qatar's Amir Sheikh Tamim calls for an end to bloodshed in Gaza in a call with US President Joe Biden. Top UN humanitarian agencies mobilize in a powerful statement calling for protection of hospitals. And finally, Qatar has joined global tech giants at the Web Summit in Portugal. Hi, this is Ali. This is The Roundup and here are today's top stories. Qatar's Amir Sheikh Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani has called for an immediate ceasefire to spare bloodshed and protect civilians in Gaza. The demand was made in a phone call with US President Joe Biden on Sunday. The Qatari leader also called for the quote permanent opening of the Rafah crossing to ensure the sustainable flow of relief convoys and humanitarian aid to Palestinians in the besieged Gaza Strip. Now a number of United Nations agencies have come together to call for urgent international action to end the ongoing Israeli attacks on hospitals in Gaza. The statement includes regional directors from UNFPA, UNICEF and the World Health Organization. It comes after days of escalating attacks on hospitals in Gaza, where doctors say patients, including babies, have started dying due to the lack of oxygen and electricity. Earlier this week, the UN confirmed at least 101 staff members have been killed in Gaza, the largest number of deaths in the organization's history. And finally, Qatar has joined global technology giants at this year's 2023 Web Summit in Lisbon, ahead of its debut hosting of the event next year. Speaking at the event in Lisbon, Qatari official Sheikh Jassim bin Mansour Al Thani said next year's hosting of the event is an investment in talents, minds, developing technology and the future and it is a winning bet on Qatar and its youth. Well that's all for today, for more stories head over to our website or download our app.